Ladies uh, and gentlemen, hello and welcome back to Stellaris. My name, of course, is Lobo Potato. We are playing as the Skaldari Confederacy. Uh, we are at war. It's kind of not a really big deal. Uh, it is, well, it is kind of a big deal considering it's the first war that we're in that is uh, out with of, uh, out with of, uh, out with our Federation, which is kind of a big deal, I suppose. Uh, we were kicked out, even System though uh, I was, I was gonna leave. I mean, let's, let's be honest, I was, I was gonna leave. I, I didn't really like uh, how they were sucking, basically. Uh, I didn't really like how they were sucking. Uh, what I would love to do, and I don't think it's gonna be possible, but I don't think we're gonna be able to get the sectors to join up anytime soon. Maybe if we took a couple of systems from our previous ally of the Alter Provinces. We are substantially more powerful than them now, which is somewhat lovely. Uh, but at the same time, it would kind of fix the fact that we're missing two Batharian stone in the sector. Well, it kind of wouldn't because we don't have any Batharian stone to uh, to, to, to go around. Unfortunately, we, we just have no Batharian stone, which sucks a heck of a lot. How long is it before we can integrate you? Uh, five years. Five years, give or take. And... It's not a huge priority to work on the integration of those guys, but it's it's another thing that we need to add to the list, I suppose. Which is, uh, well, not long, but uh, defined, I would say. May hostile maybe long is engaged. the better word. We're engaging a hostile fleet here? Really? Like, why would you... Oh my god, for fuck's sake. Engaging a spaceport, really? Is that... That's fucking stupid. It's fucking stupid. Uh, what planets are we even taking in this one? Baldun, loads in, in Baldun. Baldun over there, yeah. There's actually three planets in this system here. That's kind of crazy. That's uh, a big deal, actually. System survey complete. System survey being completed all the time. Apparently, a lot of these systems around here weren't actually surveyed, Situation which is kind of stupid because we... I don't know. I don't fucking know how it works, but whatever the case, uh, they're now being surveyed, so we'll see what... Uh, what sort of shenanigans there are in there. Lies within Alter Province space, lies within Skaldari space. Uh, let's adjust, just quickly, the Rabothner sector. Let's increase it just a smidgen. Uh, we did have that plus 10% border uh, increase, so we need to make sure that we are updating our sector list, or our sector, you know what I fucking mean. You know, we need to make sure that our sectors are up to date. As, uh, as possible. Also, in this episode, or perhaps the next one, we do intend to go to war with the Valiant Empire, because I tried to get friendly with them. Um, I tried to get friendly with them in the last episode and got a little bit frisky. It didn't really work. I was going to try and vassalize them. It wasn't possible, uh, so that kind of sucked, I guess. Okay, split in half. Split in half. You come over here. You... Come over here. There we go. And the rest of you guys go and chill out in this sector over here. I mean, there's three planets in this sector to munch down on, so it should be pretty easy to, uh, to get them to crumble. Now, do we have any armies nearby? Can we merge these two guys? Where even is this? And where, where are these two guys? And are they going to be merging kind of soon? Okay, will you guys merge? I don't fucking know where any of the troops are. Okay, come to the home world and see if we can take this. Yeah, we should be able to take that if we can get the uh, the army to come across and land it. Uh, we are at the maximum amount of influence that we can possibly be at. Uh, we don't have any groups that are really bothersome to us. Uh, what can we really spend our influence on? Nothing really, to be honest. Nothing really? There's not even... It's not even like we can just say, Oh, hey, let's buy down some of the support for, for factions. Oh, sorry, we can buy down one. That's about it. Uh, I guess we'll do this, bribe leaders, since we've got, like, shit tons of influence. Although I'm pretty sure that that's not a big deal. 
Like it's just, yeah, I mean we just wasted 200 influence, although we didn't really waste it because we've got shit tons of influence anyway. Um, yeah, either way, I'm, I'm okay with it. Okay, let's get you to come and attack this planet, and as soon as we've attacked, or as soon as we've started to attack that planet, we'll split the fleet into uh, a bunch of different little component parts. But yeah, we should be sieging everywhere out at a nice, happy pace. And we'll probably capture the home worlds very, very quickly indeed. Hey, explosive weapon damage plus 5%. Hey, research, research that. It's been a long, 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 long time since we've discovered an anomaly. Uh, Corps of Engineers, military station build cost, military station health plus 25%. I guess we'll take that. It's not an entirely big deal. Hey, look, these are the bombers. That is awesome. Situation that is awesome. Update. So I guess the bombers like kind of allow you to engage uh, from much, much further away. Okay. You come and attack there. Hostile fleet engaged. Hostile fleet engaged. Fuck off. Physics research gained. Great. Like this is this is not a fleet. That's not a fucking fleet. That is that is a singular ship. In the night sky. Alright. We bombing this planet, bombarding it. Indeed we are. Indeed we are. 46% war score already. God damn. We only need 49 more war score and then we can get our complete demands satisfied. Which is kind of nuts, I'll be honest. Land the armies. And that should be good enough. Who died? Scientist died. Let's give you another ship. Another, another leader even. Maybe anomaly research speed. Congrats. There you go. Were you the guy? Yeah, you're you're the guy that just does nothing. Uh, let's get you to come over here. There we go. Perfect. Zippity doo da zippity day. Anomaly found. Research that bad boy. Uh, yeah. So since we have to fucking survey all these systems again, it's uh, a little bit of a little bit of an annoyance. Just checking that we don't need to survey any other systems in our. Not surveyed. Look, look at this shit. We actually have to survey a shit ton of. S Jesus Christ. Jesus fucking Christ. This is really annoying. This is really, really, really annoying. Um. Gigantic skeleton. Situation. Investigate gigantic skeleton. I can get behind this. I can get behind this. Are you the guy? Yeah, fuck. Okay. Uh, you're the guy that's already planned to survey a whole bunch of places. You can come and move there, I guess. No, because you're not the not the appropriate level. All right. Well, let's replace you with somebody who's a little bit better. There we go. Society research now needs somebody, and we can get the available guy to go there. All right. Uh, duh, 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 duh. science man. Uh, research projects and system. Fantastic. That's great. That's good. Now bear in mind that we... Enemy planet secured. System enemy planet secured. Complete. Great. Great, 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 great. Uh, we are going to be probably having a couple of issues with... Uh, let's split that into there. I'll take you. You come out there, bombard that planet. You know what? That might actually just be enough. And if it's not enough... Then we'll quickly send you up to here and just sit on a planet or whatever. There we go. Let's go and do that. Should be easy enough and we should have pretty much everything that we want as soon as possible. It's, it's really fucking annoying that we're going to have to just fuck around with all star systems and whatever. Uh, offer trade deal. Can we... You give us star charts? Is that possible? I'll give you minerals for it if you want. Energy credits. Research agreement. There you go. Research agreement for 10 years if you give me your star charts. Hostile fleet engaged. Hostile fleet engaged. Really? I mean, I don't really care. You will, of course, say yes. Of course you will. And that might help us out a little bit, but I'm, I'm somewhat doubtful. 
Yeah, we still got a lot of not surveyed planets. I think that I think that the patch broke it actually. Because after after the game was patched, I think I lost a lot of resources that I was using for my space stations. Which is a little bit annoying. Just go and bombard this planet or whatever. As soon as we're in here, 84% war score. Uh minus 15. Alright, whatever. Uh split you in half. Take you. Chill out over there. GG, easy. Yeah, we're blockading so many planets right now, it's not even funny. Hostile fleet engaged. Yep, thought as much. Thought as much. It's not a not a huge problem for us. Uh, if we need 15 extra war score, we're probably going to need a, a, a little extra... A little extra oomph to get us going. I'm afraid. I don't think we'll be able to do it with just... The stuff that we've got at the moment. Uh, you come over here. There we go. Perfect. That might be enough to get us the the reward System that we require. Survey System survey complete. Yeah, look at how much new shit that I'm discovering. Which is kind of nice. But at the same time, kind of fucking annoying. Since I'm going to have to go through all of this manually and find out what I actually have surveyed and not surveyed. Yep, surveyed, surveyed. Yeah. Seems that most of it is surveyed, right? This is the ideal thing to do right now while we're waiting on a little bit of a war to conclude. Nothing else that's within our, within our borders? Special Not surveyed. Complete. Special project completed after continued studies of the massive skeletal remains found on a planet in the middle of nowhere. Whichever fucking one it is. This one? I don't know. Who knows? Uh, science officer Imas Vagras has concluded that the creature served as some kind of organic starship. Much smaller bones from at least three separate species were found with larger skeletons. We assume these come from members of the crew. For unknown reasons, this organic starship suffered failure. Who cares? It doesn't matter. Fantastic. That's great. That's just truly amazing. That is grand. What is this? Critical resource shortage. Oh no. Oh no. Critical resource shortage. How will I ever survive? Maybe I'll just trade away a bunch of my stuff. Uh, offer trade deal. Energy credits. How much will you give me? Not enough. Instant transfer. Wow, holy cow. You'll give me a lot of fucking minerals for this. Uh, and I'll give you like... An Aurelium ore, I guess? Yeah, sure. Can we get a monthly transfer as well? Holy shit, we can milk this guy for shit tons. Okay. 19 and... There we go. The maximum amount... And we have to sacrifice very little, in fact, for it. There we go. We are still running a huge deficit, I'll be completely honest, but it's it's completely fine. Situation I'm not worried in the slightest. Updated. Not worried in the slightest. Okay. That's good. You are going to bombard that planet. 97% war score. More than enough to finish the demands for everything. We'll get the demands. These two, these two systems will become mine, which is lovely, and, excuse me, there we go, alright, apparently they didn't want it, but, hey ho, anomaly found, research that anomaly, forced to return, yes, because we don't own the space, whatever, honestly, I'm completely okay with that, and it, apparently these systems are not surveyed, I don't know if that's a bug, but it seems like complete horseshit, that we have to do this. I'll be honest, but hey ho. Uh, okay, so are there any other remaining systems that need to be surveyed within our within our borders? Uh, signs of irisin activity in the vicinity of Strattle turned out to be false leads. Science officer Vis has asked to continue the search. Cool. Whatever. Uh, situation log. Don't care really about my first speaker being elected. 
Surveyed. Not surveyed. Why not? Why, dear God, have you not been surveyed? Sign a leader. Recruit somebody. Uh, research speed field manipulation. I'll just get you. Congrats. Welcome System to the team. Survey, complete. survey that. Survey that. I, I, I think that this just needs to be the guy that just goes around and does all the shit that's not been surveyed quite yet. Okay. Survey that system. Survey that system. Survey that system. I have no idea, by the way, why these systems have not been surveyed. Because we definitely took over. We definitely took over from the Gagasi round here. And quite frankly, they fucking surveyed the systems. So we should definitely get the information on the systems that they surveyed and whatever. So I, I find that it's kind of a little bit bullshit. How we are not getting this. Okay. Survey that system. Survey that system. Just do all of this. Just fucking all of it. I wish there was a command that just said, Go where you want. Survey. Survey anything. Go buck wild. System survey complete. System survey complete. If only we didn't have to do the system survey in the first place. Isn't that a isn't that a fucking great idea, eh? But that should be well, not everywhere, but most places either queued up for uh for surveying and most places already surveyed that we've inherited. Which is fine, which is fine. Engineering research, oh shit, yeah. Uh da -da 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 -da. battleship assembly yards. I've talked a little bit about doing it before. I'd rather go for strike craft speed because a strike a strike attack speed, whatever, who gives a shit. Okay, let's get all you guys to form up. Merge together. I'm only interested in one big fleet. Research. Why are we losing minerals? Edict duration. Fan fucking tastic. Who gives a shit? Uh, one point, naval capacity plus 35%, ship repair speed. I mean, that's so unnecessary since we're so overpowered at the moment. Like, I'm, I'm not even going to prioritize that. Uh, let's go to planets, take a look at our sectors, and let's actually just up the amount of resources that we're getting from everybody since we apparently need to. Which is the big sector? The gassy sector is the big one for money. So is the Cyric Vag. This is not such a big deal for us. But I guess we're just going to have to, since we're, you know, a little bit down in our luck, we'll uh, we'll just tell everybody to fucking love us. Okay. Also, this area is a little bit of a problem for us, but uh, I'm not going to worry my socks too much about it. it. Is a potentially habitable world over here. I'm interested... See... Oh... Oh shit. See, I'm interested in um I'm interested in just fucking telling somebody what to do and then getting them to do it. I'm not interested in micromanaging my my colony ships. That's just not something that I'm interested in doing. Can we purge you? Yeah, pretty sure that we're not allowed to, to purge people, you know? That's just that's just not allowed to, to happen. Research the anomaly. One of these days, the anomaly is going to give us bad luck and it's going to kill our guys. Can't declare war on you yet. 89, though. Not long. You're at war with those guys still, so... Hey-ho. The Math and Stellar Empire. It's going down. And it's going down pretty darn hard. I, I, I don't care. This is this is not my concern. Look, just uh, create a new sector, I guess. Wait, what? What? Is our... Did I see that right? Wow, we've got a first... A synthetic. Jesus Christ, I did not realize that we had uh, somebody that was in charge that was not our own species. Warp impact. A massive crater on... Hamcad 5 appears to be the result of a collision with a starship. From the size of the crater, we suspect that a ship traveling at full warp rammed the planet for reasons unknown roughly 10,000 years ago. Remarkable. Indeed, remarkable it is. I don't care. Give me a new sector. Let's create a new sector. There we go. 
grand. Suddenly the problems over here, not my problems. What I wish, what I wish I could do, right? What I absolutely wish I could do is just to go, okay, I want this area to be colonized, right? This area to be colonized and everybody get on with it. But unfortunately, I cannot do that. That is something that is out with my control. And if I want to, I need to manually tell everybody to colonize this area. So what do we need? Arid world, arid, continental, arid. So who does who does arid? Is it the 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 the, 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 the Mathin? Holy shit! The Mathin are actually really good at colonizing. Uh, expansion influence cost requires a colony ship. Oh shit! So apparently, apparently they introduced a modifier which is wow, which which requires which requires influence. Fuck me! All right. Uh, that's not too much of a problem, but it's going to slightly slow down our expansion a little bit, I suspect. Not too much, I should hope, but hey-ho. Uh, any resources up here that we really care about? Not really, to be honest. Not really at all. We care about the blue stuff that we don't have any. You know that little stardust, the pixie dust thing that we currently System care about? Yeah, we're, we're working on it, but we're not really getting anywhere at, uh, at a hugely fast System pace. But at least we're going to have the opportunity to get a couple more anomalies. That's a couple of interesting storylines, I think, that uh, that could be happening. Uh, this is very, very, very popular. How fast? Chance, 20% chance to gain 10% support a month. Well, it's a good thing that we've got all of this uh, good old-fashioned influence to spend. Spent from 1,000 all the way down to... 285. Good thing that we've been banking it up, eh? You know, can't underestimate how, how useful influence actually is. Why are these two not merged? Why are we not merged here, guys? Because we should be. We should be. We should also continually be manufacturing more stuff on Skaldaria. Comet sighted a small celestial object with pronounced gaseous and particulate tails was recently observed in the Skaldon system. Its passing was uneventful. Hey! References. Uh, also, something that we should probably do is go into the template designer and get rid of all the fucking shit templates that... Anomaly found. Anomaly found research. Get rid of the shit templates that are not necessary. Complete. The cruiser one, and even you. In fact, let's have a look at you, actually. What have you got? You're kind of cool, I guess. You're kind of cool. You're very cool, in fact. I kind of like you, but... I like the way that this looks. I really do. I also like the fact that it's got, like, shields for days. That's kind of nice. But I like my old talk, no walk, bad boy, a little bit better. The large weapons really do, really do pack a punch. Which is kind of what I'm going for. Interesting. Great. Don't care what it is. Don't really care to read it. Just care to make some progress and move on. And sooner rather than later, and when I say sooner rather than later, I mean in the very next episode, we are going to be going to war with two people. Two people we're going to be going to war with, ladies and gents. Math and Stellar Empire. Fingers crossed we've got enough to integrate them. Vassalize. Oh my god, you fucking kidding me. Um... That's fucking annoying. Well, I guess we're just going to be taking as much as we possibly can. And the next war after that, I guess, will be will be vassalizing. Uh, which kind of sucks. Unless we can somehow liberate all planets. Nope. Nope, that's not possible. Hey-ho. Ladies and gents, thank you very, very much for watching. My name, of course, has been Open Potato. This has been Stellaris playing, of course, as the Skaldari Confederacy. I'll see you next time. Bye.